I don't understand the big deal people are making over the Google logo change. What's the big deal? You know, The Guardian has a whole article about it, and I'm just going, okay. And they have this thing in here. It says, it doesn't simply tell you that you're using Google, but also shows you how Google is working for you. For example, new elements like a colorful Google mic help you identify and interact with Google, whether you're talking, tapping, or typing. Meanwhile, we're bidding adieu to the little blue G icon and replacing it with a four-color G that matches the logo. But also shows you how Google is working for you. A logo does all that, huh? I wish that there would be some company, some larger company, that would start to allow us to customize the content that is ours. Say what you want about what MySpace used to be. You could customize a lot of stuff on it. The old YouTube, before Google bought it out, you used to be able to customize your pages. Now, you couldn't customize the video page, but I think that would be cool too. Whatever happened to that idea of people being able to make things look like the way they want? Now, I mean, granted, people could put porn images in those things, and... I can understand why they would have a problem with that, but I mean, it'd be the same as reporting porn that gets uploaded to YouTube itself. Another thing that they could just have some sort of algorithm that, that looks for certain things like, you know, is someone making a background and a font color that disallow you to be able to read it? You know, and say, uh, no, you can't do that. You need to make this readable. That wouldn't be very hard. But, you know, them changing their logo means, but also shows you how Google is working for you. Oh, I'm so happy. Do you think they'll actually start to work on their products? We'll see. We'll see.